Tonight, dozens came together to remember an 18-year-old who was shot on Sunday in Battle Creek. And the family of Cameron Williams says he died of his injuries the following day. News Channel 3's Maria Serrano met them at a vigil in his honor tonight. She is live now in studio where Maria Williams' mom warned her son's friends that crime, violence, and retaliation are all dead ends. That's right, Andy. The mother of Cameron pleading with teens to stop the violence. Lanterns and balloons being released to the sky tonight. Dozens of family and friends grieving the loss of a teen they say was full of life and taken too soon. A young man shot and killed. Yeah, y'all need to get started right now. Tonight, dozens gathering in loving memory of Cameron Williams. Sad, heartbroken, devastated. A family left in the dark, no answers from police. All they know is Cameron is not coming back. And getting the light them up. Oh, there we go. There we go. We got some action. Tonight, they're lighting up the sky with lanterns. We gotta let them go. And filling it with balloons in his memory. But even in her grief, Cameron's mom looks out for others with a message tonight for other teens. The kind of gun violence that killed her son could be a dead end for them, too. Once you lay down, ain't no getting up from that. So y'all need to learn a lesson. And it was made loud and clear. Everybody come out here, get balloons, cry, and then they go do the same stupid stuff. Crystal Baker, okay. Cameron's cousin, says the family hopes to bring awareness of teen violence. Well, they need to know that life isn't a game. The violence has to stop. It's senseless and it's meaningless. They hope one message sticks out of this tragedy. Stop the violence. It's not worth it. The pain is real. The heartache is real. The suffering is real. My son gone. Ain't no more coming back from that. And it hurt. That's my only child. Family members say Cameron was a recent graduate of Kalamazoo Central High School. They tell me they don't know why he was shot or who shot him. Battle Creek police say this is an ongoing investigation. And then, of course, when we know more, we will share that with you. I'm live in studio. Maria Serrano, News Channel 3. A former